Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon to you one and all. This is Little Daffodil coming to you today from Farm Manager 2018, where the farm is in trouble. The farm is in trouble. I mean, it was in trouble when I got here. Uh, the hurricane had taken it out. The, 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 the mom or the grandmom had died. I don't know. It was just, it was tragic. It was tragic. The hurricane had ripped the place apart, and there was loss in the family, and it was terrible, terrible, terrible. Since then, we've built up the farm. Okay, we have, we have, and we're not completely broke yet, but now everything is getting dry and the season is coming to an end. It's now September and I don't know, I don't know if we're going to make it. I don't know. So let's see, we need to bring this crop in, but I don't have enough employees. Uh, this guy over here is still planting the, the, the tomatoes and everything's going dry on me. Everything's, oh, my cherries are dry now too. Do we have anyone free who can, can work on the cherries real quick? No, no. And I don't hire another employee because, you know, there's there's only so much money to go around. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Harvested crops. Corn. I must have harvested that one. I was thinking I was doing something else to it. I, oh, that's right. I harvested it rather than treating it for the buggage. That's what it was. All right. So these, they've just been, they're being moisturized still. She's going over to take care of that. This one is still being harvested and this needs to be harvested. And then on top of that, I have the chicken guy watering over here. He's done. So let's have him water over here and then he can go back and look at his chickens for a minute. So let's accept that choice Too little moisture. And then over here, Okay, first of all, we need something to water with over here. We do not even have a well on this end. Wrong button. This button. And I can't afford, like, formal irrigation systems. That's just not in the cards at the moment. Let's go ahead and put the well right there. Okay, so that's something. Uh, let's see. How are we doing? Okay, let's move time forward muchly faster. That is watered. Okay. And that one is watered. Okay, now I need everybody who's free. I don't have anybody working on silage either. That's not good. But I, I, let's save the trees. Okay, both of you. Go water the trees. Don't let's be losing the trees now. As soon as they're done harvesting the lupine, we'll set those two loose on the bigger field. And then hopefully by then, let's see, is this guy almost done? He is done. So he can go back to looking after his cows. Oh, we're done with that task. We're done with that task. So we're back in chapter three, a breath of modernity. You're hoping I didn't spend everything on the machines. Well, I tried not to. You told me what to buy though. So I'm just going to say whatever I spent, it was at your request, Pops. You're telling me what to do. Okay. So using renewable energy sources. Oh, I love that. Okay. So I need to go to renewable energy sources training and then build a wind farm. Use of renewable energy sources. All right, let's slow time again. Let's put this guy back on his cows. So they are taken care of. We need to take a class. So we click on the house. Agriculture, machining, there is a lot of training. A lot of training options, but we're looking for renewable energy sources so that's 2200 <laughs> and that's going to take a little while to complete seven days left so it tells us up there okay so we have seven days left for that class uh let's see have we finished harvesting this almost i believe they're on it now how are we doing on the watering so we can get back to taking care of the chickens and the silage how's the how's the watering over here going Okay, they're working on it. So let's do, let's move time forward quick, quick again. Not double quick, but quick. Okay. And what's next? Oh, it's always a question of what's next. Fungus on my fields. Really? Really? This field over here needs to stop with the fungal problems. You know, maybe it should stop sharing its uh, shower slippers. No, not anti-weed. I, 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 I lie. Antifungal. And is anyone free? Luke, Luke, go take care of that. And then we'll put you back on your chickens, dude, okay? We'll put you back on your chickens. And then we're going to put 
Saren, 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 I'm not sure how to pronounce that one, I have to admit. We're going to put her back over here on the silage so that the cows will get what they need. And then once he's done there, we'll take care to put the chickens guy back on the chickens. Okay, the weather's going to turn here anytime now, I think. We're in autumn. We are in autumn. What was that message? Okay, fungus on your field, we're taken care of. Field is ready for harvest. I know, I know. Animals ready for breeding. We're going to hold off on the breeding of the chickens. I need them to finish this field. And when they're done with that field, they can go work on this field. Okay? Although I could free up the, the, the cow guy to help with that. I really could. And I should see about educating some more. I really should. That is a thing I should do. How are we doing? Still not done. Come on. Oh, now they're done. Nope. No, they're not done. They were done. All right, let's let's see what Leanne's good at. Endurance and machine. Um, is endurance something you can really, you know, go to a class for? Actually, if I cl click on the little house over here too, that helps. Let's see. Plants. The skill of care for the size of the hardest. Oh, let's do that one. We'll train her up a little bit because we want to keep our employees happy. So that's good. Is this ready to harvest yet? No, 180. Cherries take a while to get to the point where they're good to go. All right. We're going to need to build the wind turbine, but we can't do that, I think, until we're done with the class. How are we doing over here? You are done. All right. So how many people have we got to work on this one? Out of fill. All right. Let's clear Luke. Put you two on that. And then let's have Luke grab the sunflowers. Looks like the chickens are still doing okay on their own over there. They're fine. They're okay. And this sunflower is for them. Let's speed time up quite a bit. And let's see. Everybody should be fully occupied at the moment. Ernie's back on the cows. Ah, Ernie, we're going to have to pull you off the cows to water the tomatoes. Sorry. You planted them. You're invested now, dude. Okay, so let's go. Hang on. I have finished the class. Okay, so now I should be able to build the thing they want me to build. It's going to cost me 60,000 monies. I don't have 60,000 monies. Uh, and I can't take out a loan. I don't think. How do I take out a loan? Okay, pause. We're pausing. Okay. Um, you know, if you want me to buy something, <laughs> you should let me have the money for it, game. Okay, I need to take practical training and negotiation skills and training in banking one. So, practical training in oh, $6,500 monies. Okay, and banking one. Apparently, uh, it's one at a time. All right. Because I need the monies. <laughs> and it's going to take me 20 days. Alright, let's get back to farming. <laughs> Alright, you're doing your thing over there. Nobody's working on the chickens and nobody's working on them. Because we don't have the manpower. We have 31,000 coin, but we don't have enough for everything we need. So I'm going to have to earn the money in order to build. Or get to a point where I can take it alone. Uh, in order to build that wind turbine thingy mama joppy biggy thing the biggy thing so let's see oh these are ready to harvest is there anybody free is there anybody available no no there is not that is an issue okay let's go ahead and get nobody everybody's busy <laughs> Everybody's busy. There's nobody to harvest the strawberries. And that could be income, people. That could be one of your salaries. Come on. Get working. You know, I can't sell the sunflowers. I don't know if the chickens are worth it. If I can't sell any of the crops I'm harvesting over there on that end of the world. Because they're to feed the chickens. So what go to the chickens? I mean, alright, let's see what we can sell. Well, everybody's busy. Is that done? That's done. So, wait a minute. We're going to hang on. We'll go see what we can sell in just a second. Let's go and harvest this stuff. I should use the autofill more. I really should. Let's do that. 
and then let's see what we can sell. And hopefully nobody will run away. No, no, no more animals will get loose. A cow is enough. All right, we have grass, sunflower, corn, and lupine. Those are for everybody to have. I mean, how am I going to sell the chicken eggs? I just don't know that the chickens are all that valuable. I don't know that they're really making us any money. But the milk, the milk makes us more. Not a lot, but could you imagine if I had like 20 cows? I have a bit of straw. I don't know what to do with the straw. I'm assuming that's good for the cows too. So we're going to keep it. We are not going to sell that. All right. The strawberries got harvested, but I don't know if I sold them. Hang on. Oh, let's put Ernie. Uh, no, Ernie, you don't work the chickens. All right. Back to the market. Sell the strawberries. Where are the strawberries? No, nope, not buy. I want to sell. Sell all of them. It's not a whole lot. It's a tiny little field. All right, now let's put Ernie back here, where he belongs. What about, where'd he go? Oh, I, got him, I, I gave him another job, didn't I? I sent him off to do something else. What about over here? Is, is, oh no. Ernie, I put you on the chickens, I'm sorry. I was kidding. It, it wasn't intentional. I know you love your cows. Luke's free. Luke can go back and work on the chickens. Oi, they were going to have a fight there for a second, I thought. You know, those are his chickens. He doesn't want to share his chickens. Automatically call the inseminator. No, we're not automatically calling the inseminator. We have 20 chickens right now. We're good. Work the chickens you got, dude. Okay, so where are we at? Will we train any worker to max level? Finishing, finished use. Okay, we did the training thing. We're going to reject that. We're not going to spend the money to train them. Only get a thousand back. And we have eight more days to finish that class. Okay, that's fine. That's okay. We can deal with that. How are our tomatoes doing? The moisture's good. The soil was cultivated. I'm just ho I'm hoping that was a good thing. Uh, so we have gathered in a harvesting of the lupine, a harvesting of the corn. I don't know if, see how this has got a full green bar there, right? And then this one, no green bar up here. And this one has a green bar. So does that mean these crops have to be, they'll come back? Or does it mean they won't come back? Because like the grass just keeps coming back. It's grass, it grows, right? Lupine, I don't know if it does or not. And the other two, I don't think they do. Oh, see that says perennial plant. Let's look at that. Collect bales. What do you mean collect bales? Collected bales, okay. So these are not perennial plants. And I don't know if crop rotation's a thing. I don't, but I do think that it would be a good time to make those fields a little bit more, a little bit better shape. Scare the birds that are destroying your fields. Where are they? How do I scare them? What do I do to scare them? And where are they? I don't know. Let's go ahead and uh, do I want to destroy the field on which sunflower grows? Well, I don't know if it's going to come back. Pops, come back and give me some advice. I don't know what to do. Pops. At the very least, I should fertilize it, don't you think? Because we really didn't do anything to that field. Let's go ahead and, can I do that? No. All right, let's plow it. Let's go ahead and plow it. We're going to do that. Is there anyone actually free to do that? No, there isn't. <laughs> that, was a, that was a pipe dream there, a little laugh. That was a pipe dream. Because right now what you need is for things to finish up. 13 days for strawberries. Oh, my negotiation skill training is done. 166 days left for the, tr for the cherries still. It says I have, I have, where, where are these birds that are destroying my field? Oh, they're over here. How do I destroy them? How do I scare them off? Oh, I click on them. Is that it? Okay, yay, I did that. What do I get for it? Can I have some money? <laughs> I need some more money. All right, now I have finished that training. I want to do, what was it, banking skills level one? Because we need some, some monies. And we need to take it alone. So I need, what did I do wrong? 
negotiation skills, agriculture, machine training. What, how, how do I... How do I get a loan? Now what do I need to do? Training and banking one. Okay, maybe it's under T. I'm looking under B. Training and banking one. 2,000 monies. <sighs> yeah. You gotta get... You gotta spend money to borrow money, I guess, is the... Uh, it's the lesson there. <laughs> Y'all. All right, so how are we doing? Crops. I don't think I have crops to use. I do have some straw, but I wanna hang on to that. I, I don't really know how that helps. I kinda wish there was a little bit more information about how some of these things can and can't help the process. Um, Cause I kinda get it, but I don't really get it. You know what I mean? Cause I don't know anything about farming. The trees are changing colors though. I love that. Uh, I lived in New England for a very long time. The changing of the seasons are a wonderful, wonderful thing. And I do miss that. I miss that still after all these years in Florida. I miss it every year. All right, so hopefully we have enough feed for the animals. Uh, that is empty. So that is nerve wracking because I don't know if we have enough seed for the winter. Which would mean, of course, we'd have to buy some. Which would kind of be a bummer. It would be a bummer. I'd really like to get to the point in this episode, though, where I can build that wind turbine. So I need to borrow the monies. Pops, you didn't talk about borrowing the monies. So hopefully I'm doing the right thing. All right, how are we doing? Is everybody still busy? Can we do anything? Harvesting, harvesting. Cow shed storage, chickens. All right, yeah, so everybody's busy. Busy, 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 busy bees. And I can't go any faster forward. Because I want them to finish what they're doing. Alright, let's free up. Weather alert. Too low a temperature. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. We're going to put Saren over here. I want to plow this field. I do. I know it's not your main thing, but trust me. It'll be worth it. You know what I should be doing? I should be keeping an eye on my monies and figuring out when they get paid. Whether it's monthly, quarterly. I mean, what's what's the income here? All right, apparently cow's milk just went up in price, which is good for me. Um, because I, I may not have any stored right now, I don't know. Let's click on here. Warehouse, I have grass and silage. Yeah, I haven't tried to sell any. And the chickens, the chickens want to be allowed to breed again. They love that. They, they want to do that all the time. I want to breed the cows. <laughs> I want to breed more cows because I want to have more milk to sell. No, I don't want to buy anything. I want to sell. What do I have to sell? Okay, so we have a little bit of this and a little of that. Let's sell all the chicken eggs. Let's sell all the milk. Ooh, that's, that's a nice chunk of change. That'll put us back over 30,000 monies for a change. One of the animals are saying, no, no, no sickness. Call the vet. Yeah, I said that too soon. Now I'm spending money for the vet. No sickness with the cows. The cows are my money maker right now. And I'm not losing me a cow. Cows, you need a blanket. Should, should I check your temperature? Not sure I'm willing to, but hey, the vet's here. The vet, the vet will check your temperature. Does that mean you're all better now? Okay, I hope so. All right, yes, good job over there plowing away. And you're harvesting. And that grass, that grass is going to keep the cows fed. So all these fields over here next to the grass are all about keeping the animals alive. So you know what? Oh, I need some. Oh, no, look over here. Oh, I have problems. I have problems. Okay. Cow guy. I hope your cows are fine for the moment because you're going to go pick up strawberries. Let's harvest those. The crop quality is terrible. Oh, <laughs> that's not good. I finished my training in banking one. Okay, I'll, I'll get to that in a second. I need to go save my tomato crop. So let's go water those. Out of fill. Oh, all you guys are free. Okay. Uh, no, not you, Ernie. Um, we want chicken guy. Except, because Ernie, you're supposed to be collecting the strawberries. Why aren't you collecting the strawberries? Are you done with the strawberries? Let's pause, because obviously the game is getting ahead of me here for a second. So we're going to put Ernie back there. 
and then we're gonna go sell the strawberries. We're gonna sell everything they'll let us sell. <laughs> we're gonna try and keep the farm alive. Wait a minute, okay, I'm clicking too many buttons, too many times. Let's sell what we have for milk, infinite, all. I don't have a whole lot, but what I got, because I just did a sell, 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 sell here a minute ago. Where are the strawberries? You said you had strawberries. I know they're low quality. You harvested them. Animals are ready for breeding. Drought on your field. Yes, of this I am aware. Everybody's coming to fix that. All right, maybe he hasn't put the strawberries in the warehouse yet, so I can't sell them. So let's run time on. And see if they show up now. I might have just been a little too fast. No, I don't know. Maybe I, did I sell the strawberries and not observe myself selling the strawberries? It could be. It could be the case. Wouldn't have surprised me in the least. There are times when strange things happen. Someone's still working on that? Oh, Saren is still working on that. Okay, go Saren, go. Get her done. All right. And you're, where are you going? Oh, you're going over there to do that. Good, 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 good. Hey, the three of them should knock that soil moisture issue out. No problem. And I think before winter sets in, which should be soon, it's November. Why isn't it snowing yet? It should be snowing. It's November. Oh, we finished our class. Hang on. Alone. Let's get alone. Oh, oh. let's get alone. You've never seen someone so excited to get alone. Okay, so I have options. The more money I get, the longer the installments and the lower the interest rate. Now, if this were real life, I would consider the proportional implications of this. I would say, all right, that gives me four years at 5%, and I would do all the calculating. That gives me three years at 8% and do all the calculations. And yeah, mm -hmm, I'm just going to take this loan right here. Thank you very much. Can I have this one? No, you won't. This is the most you'll let me have. It's 200000 not a million. And I have two years to pay it off at 10%. Okay, fine. <laughs> This isn't going to go well. <laughs> this is going to go very poorly. All right. Let's pause. Let's pause for a moment. And let's go ahead and build the wind turbine. Let's finish that task. That costs 60 monies. Right there. 60,000 monies, to be clear. All right. Let's put it over here, kind of hopefully out of the way. Right there. So let's move time on. Let them build that. It looks like they've taken care of the tomatoes. This field is in process. Let's go ahead and make some improvements to this field over here. Yes, I do. Let's autofill. We have Leanne. Leanne is free. Okay. Where is my chicken guy? Where is he? I thought he was working on the tomatoes as well. Yeah, because Ernie's back with his cows. Maybe he was doing the strawberries. Too low a temperature for this perennial. I know. If I could, I'd just put hay over it and winterize them. So, to s yeah. See, they're looking sad. They're looking sad. So, where is Ernie? Where is he? Uh, no, Luke's. Oh, he's watering something. What is he watering? Oh, that's, they're still working on the tomatoes? Man, come on, guys. By the time you get the tomatoes done, they're going to have built my wind turbine. And Leanne should be working on that. Yeah, I want to fertilize these two fields. And then I'll replant, replant them in the spring, I think. But let's get the turbine up. Let's speed time on a little bit. Let's get the turbine up. And then we will see where we are at. I don't know if the, I think the turbine gets me 10 monies, 10 monies a month or something, which is nice, but it's really not going to do a lot for me. I need some income. I really need a decent income. I'm hoping the campaign system will lead me to that road because, you know, it could take ages to make money at this rate. And I never would have gotten through this, if this step in the process, if I hadn't taken out the loan, which is a little disconcerting. But that is, yeah, it'll pay off in about two and a half years. You'll earn the most on windy days, 
Uh, but enough about wind farms. It's time to strengthen animal husbandry. You already know how to deal with chickens, how to produce cheap food for them. I need to care for 20 chickens and breed 50 eggs. Okay. So now we have actually done this. Is he free yet? Yes, put Luke back to work. And I guess we're going to have to start breeding them. And just run through... Oh, call the inseminator. I want more cows. It's cows. Cows are good for business. All right, so keep an eye on everything. That's 12 days left. I think it's way too cold. I think that the strawberries are going to come up later. The cherry trees, too low. Those, I don't know if those are ever going to give me anything. How are my apple trees? How are they doing? They have 193 days, and it's a low crop quality. I did sort of fertilize the field. That's got to count for something. <sighs> but they have a long time to go. Still two. Okay, we're recultivating. We're replowing. We're re not replowing. They were never plowed. We're plowing those two fields. So it looks like right now the key thing is concentrating on getting those chickens going and maybe taking some classes. I don't know. I don't know how much I want to deviate from what the game is asking me to do because the point of the campaign I think is to do the parts within the campaign and I don't know what I'm jumping ahead now because I am well beyond at this point what I have done uh what I did in learning to understand the game mechanics so I, I don't know what's going to happen next and I don't know if I'm going to be jumping ahead too much if I do things that seem like a good idea um because I want to <laughs> all right so how often do I have to make payments I don't know I don't know that either Oh, it has my whole account history. The purchase and sale of things. Um, yeah. Probably a very depressing thing to look at. Oh, a report. Oh. Yeah, see, cow's milk makes a lot more money than chickens. So I can see why Pops concentrated on cows. Although they're more expensive to get overall. I've made 3500 off those contracts, um, the bets and the contracts and stuff. Okay. Forest maintenance. I must be from the trees I took down. That's pretty good. Maybe I should just knock down a few trees when I'm, I'm low on money. <laughs> I'll run out of trees, though, if I can't build more of them or grow more of them, obviously. Okay. And the strawberries have brought me some, some money, but not a whole lot more than the chicken eggs. I don't know. All right, this is what I have in the warehouses right now. And trade. It looks, it looks like I can set up auto trading. Oh, I've produced my 50 eggs. Yay. All right, well, I think that's going to do it for this episode, folks. We're going to keep working with the chickens and see if we can get through to the next step in our story in uh, Farm Manager 2018. Yeah, I think that's going to be it for today, folks. This is Little Daffodil thanking you, as always, for joining me, and I will see you in the next episode.